Patrick Willis, the best linebacker I've ever seen play, did not get elected into the NFL Hall of Fame this year. Here's who did. Rondé Barber, Darrell Rivas, Joe Thomas, Zach Thomas, DeMarcus Ware. Hey, these are all fine, wonderful, excellent players who had terrific careers. Uh, but P Patrick Willis was the best, hands down, the best linebacker of his generation. Who was better than him when he played? Who? Ray Lewis? Ray Lewis was old when Patrick Willis was in the league. Patrick Willis was hands down the best linebacker. He could do everything at an elite level. He could go sideline to sideline. He could cover. He could blitz. He could take the ball away. He was everything you wanted. And he's not in the Hall of Fame yet. He'll make it in eventually, but Zach Thomas? That, Zach, in what world was Zach Thomas half the linebacker Patrick Willis was? So, I don't know. I, I, I feel like there's a trend here. Who made it in? Well, Rondé Barber played most of his career uh, with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Darrell Drevis, the New York Jets. Joe Thomas, Cleveland Browns, Zach Thomas, Miami Dolphins, and uh, DeMarcus Ware, Dallas Cowboys. The first four guys played uh, in the Eastern time zone, and DeMarcus Ware played for America's team. It's almost like the NFL and its voters think that the USA stops at Dallas. Like, that's as far west as it gets, and everything west of that doesn't really matter or count. I mean... They got to have some better West Coast representation in the Hall of Fame. It's like they've never heard of Patrick Willis. Who's that? Oh, he wasn't a big self-promoter, and he played in Santa Clara, so I've never heard of him. He was all pro like every year. Just because he's a little quiet and he played out here on the in the Pacific uh, time zone, people pretend like they didn't watch him play. Stay up later. It's ridiculous. It's a travesty. Gotta get Patrick Willis in the Hall of Fame. This is silly.